and half woman. It's Gary. I want to hip you to the teeth. All right, Ricky, it's about the morning show. Scary has the tea and the color of the day. Gary, good morning. Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, America. Good morning to you. It's Monday, a beautiful day in the neighborhood. And here's what's happening in celebrity news, y'all. It's being reported, y'all, that women all over the world are loving and praising Mr. Dwayne Wade, y'all. Now, they're saying, y'all, that Dwayne Wade and his beautiful wife, Miss Gabrielle Union, are one of the most famous and popular black couples in the world. Now, they're saying that the NBA legend and his A-list actress wife, Miss Gabrielle Union, are hashtag couple goals, y'all, for millions of people all over the world. Now, it's been reported that we all know y'all that Dwayne and Gabrielle, they have a little bit of a non-traditional marriage. Now, they're saying y'all that the ways are not shy about letting people in on the inner workings of their marriage. Now, recently, y'all, Dwayne Wade, y'all, provided some commentary on their marriage, and women are seeing his praises. Now they're saying y'all that the NBA star was asked whether he thought a man should lead in a marriage, and he responded that that is not the man's role to lead, but to. St- and they're saying that women are going crazy over that response, y'all. He said that it's not the man's. It's not. The man leads and the woman follows. That's not what we live in our house. He said, for me, he said, I have a wife that works not just as hard, but harder than I. She had her own career, her own life before I came along. He said, from my perspective, he said, I was like, how can I be a part of the growth, the evolution of who she is, not try to change her or stunt her growth? Right. And and they're saying women, and, and women should lead. I think women should lead no. because men, yeah, yeah women should lead because when That's men lead, they take male. the money. When they lead, they take the money and give it out to other women and cheat on the wife. So if the woman leaves, she have all the money there and she'll be able to issue out, you know, give him his allowance, what he needs and stuff. And, and, and oh, leave please. Well, I'm Gary, not sure if you, that's you, quite you what You define the ultimate lead. beta male. Uh, what? You define what? the ultimate beta male. What's what that? What does that mean? The man who follows his woman. That ain't that. that, that ain't, uh, hen, we call it a hen picked. Oh. That's not how this works. So it's okay for a woman to follow a man, but not okay for a man to follow a woman. Well, according to the Bible. <laughs> what? The, the, the Bible? I know the you didn't throw the hen picked. What do I know? I don't know. Omitted stuff. What do I know? Boy, please. <laughs> what do not, I know? Not much. Uh oh. <laughs> Ain't no boys over here. Oh, come on, I'm telling now. you. Rock T, do you male. lead or you let Crystal lead? Hey man, we even. It's a hundred percent, a hundred percent, man. You know what I'm saying? Nice. I don't, I don't, I don't believe in. I think people are are, are, are are misconstruing what this lead thing is all about. You know what I'm saying? Right. Yes, the man is the man of the house, but doggone it, the woman is the woman of the house. It's a king and queen. I think you know you you, you lead wow. together. You got to lead together, in my opinion. Oh, really? There uh-huh. you go. He there said go, that, Rock T. Nah, they can't um, have two pilots. Somebody got to be the co-pilot. <laughs> <laughs> they both can't sit in the same seat. That's all I'm saying. It's two seats up there. No, but that, that's it's yeah. t- exactly. It's two one's seats pilot, up there. One's the pilot. One's the co-pilot. Room they both need it. You, you, know? you can be happy. They what change I'm seats. You can be happy. You can be happy. You can have drama in your life. Your whole doggone marriage. Right. Which one you want? Talking saying. about who thank you, you are. Thank you. Which, which one you want, right. Special K? And I I'm think the reason why the women are so excited is said. because it's choice word of support. <laughs> it's not like she's trying to take his place because I think a real woman doesn't want to take a man's place. We can't be a man. A man can only be a man. But a woman is a bona fide person not to be underestimated. And the fact that he is there to support is everything because that's all we really want. Hello. Mm. All right, so hey. there you go, Special K. Said all right, said. moving on in other celebrity <laughs> news, y'all. <laughs> congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations, y'all. Go out to Fantasia, y'all. It's being reported, y'all, that Fantasia gave birth to, uh, to her third child, a baby girl named Kaziah Taylor. Now, they're saying yes. that they're saying right. now the baby's arrival yes. on Instagram. Now, they're saying this is the first child for Fantasia and her husband, Kendall. And they're saying, but she has two more kids from previous relationships. So, congratulations goes out to um, Fantasia. And while we're congratulating, congratulations goes out to Nick Cannon. He's expecting his seventh child with Miss Alyssa Scott. Oh. Y'all, now, she's a model on Wild and Out. Now, they're saying, y'all, this Scott announced her pregnancy online with a photo of the maternity um, shoot. Now, she captioned the photo, Zen S. Cannon. Now, they're saying when somebody asked um, if Nick, Nick was the father, she responded with heart eye emojis. Now, they're saying that Nick Cannon welcomed a child with Miss Brittany Bell in December, and they also um, share a four-year-old son. Now, Cannon is also the father of 10-year-old twins, Moroccan and Monroe Cannon, and he's also expecting twins with Miss Abby De La Rosa. So, congratulations goes out to Nick Cannon, y'all. The color of the day, honey, is one of my favorite colors. My color of the day, y'all, is fairy wing. On the high end, you say fairy wing, and on the low end, you say beautiful, dirty pink. That's your color for today. All right, y'all, give it up for Gary with the team.